Okay guys, so I just washed my hair and it's still pretty soaking wet. Um, the only thing I'm doing right now is combing it. So the only thing I'm going to be adding in my hair right now is just some Eco Styler gel. You can use this gel or either the one with the red lid. That's what I normally use. I'm going to use this one today so I can go ahead and get rid of the last little bit. I put Eco Styler gel in my hair, number one, because it will keep my hair laid down for uh, as long as I need it to until, it, until I want to wash it again um, and I don't have to mess with it. And I will add some oil to it once it dries. So I'm going to go ahead and put the gel on. And I just put the gel on in the way that I combed my hair, which is to the front and down the sides and then to the back. and let it dry throughout the day and then at night time I'll put some oil on it to keep it from uh, getting dry and so to have some sheen to it and then I'll wear it uh, until I'm ready to wash the gel out. I normally wear it two days at the most because I like to keep my hair fresh looking since it's so short now Sometimes, depending on my mood, I wash it every day. Um, not with shampoo, with conditioner. Sometimes I'll just rinse all the gel out. Um, just depends on what works for you. When I first went natural uh, three years ago, I would wash my hair every single day with conditioner. Um, and those of you who've been natural for a while, you know that the moisture is really, really good for your hair. So I don't mind wetting it every day because it's, that's going to help my hair to grow. And all I'm going to do is cut it back off again until I'm ready for it to start back growing out again. Um, but the moisture, the water will help your hair grow at a fast rate because your hair loves water and it needs the moisture. But this is all that I do, guys. Some of you may think it's a lot of gel, and it's not really that much. I just like mine to lay down really good because my hair curls up so quickly as soon as I put it on, and I just like for it to be flat. Um, since I cut my hair this short, I like it so much better when it's really flat for some reason. I don't know why. I just think it looks better. I did wear it curled up the other day though and it was still really really cute so it just depends on what you like and what your preference is. So I pretty much got it all over the way that I want and then I'm just going to grab my comb again and just comb it in a style. already curling up here it won't even because it's already growing back so fast but I'll get it cut low or again like I had whenever I first cut it off so this is all I'm doing and this is all that I pretty much do to style my hair at this length there aren't but so many things that you can do to it which is the main reason I got it cut, so I don't have to do much to it at all. Alright guys, so that's it. The last thing that I'm going to do is just get the um, excess gel off of my forehead which isn't much on my forehead and down the sides of my face and just take your towel and just clean it off like so get behind your ears and then go across the back of your neck okay this is what the back looks like Alright guys, so thank you for tuning in. I hope this was helpful to some of you all. I will be doing more videos on my hair. I'm going to try to think of 
more things that I can do to it. Um, especially for you ladies with hair that's the same length as mine. Um, there are some things that we can do to it. I just gotta figure it out. <laughs> I gotta figure it out and I will uh, be sure to share it with you guys. Um, oh, and the oil that I'm gonna put on my hair once it dries is my um, Tropic Isle Living Jamaican Black Castor Oil. All right, so thank you guys for tuning in. To all of my new subscribers, welcome to my channel. I'm so happy to have you, and thank you for subscribing, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.